Jenny Eclair auditioned for the ITV skating show, but revealed it didn't go to plan and insisted she wasn't asked to return. She told Express.co.uk, I auditioned for the skating. One, but I don't think I was bad enough to be funny or showed enough potential for improvement. Express.co.uk has contacted a representative for Dancing on Ice and ITV for a comment. The 58-year-old comedian also revealed she couldn't imagine taking on Channel 4 show The Jump because she is really C asterisk asterisk P at skiing. She added, I am sadly really C asterisk asterisk P, I have tried skiing and I couldn't do it, I just couldn't get to the starter slope. Jenny managed to tackle I'm a celebrity, get me out of here, in 2010 where she came in third place, losing up to winner Stacey Solomon and runner-up Sean Ryder. Admitting the experience was her hardest, yet, she divulged, I thought the jungle one was the hardest, it was really really hard, I thought it was mentally and physically tough and we had very bad weather, the comedian added she learned a lot about other people during her jungle experience. She went on, I made good friends and learned a lot about other people, I don't know whether I learned anything about myself but I learned about how other people tick and why people tick like they do, when asked for an example, she replied, nothing that anybody would understand, despite having a busy tour schedule, Jenny admitted she would love to have her own TV show focused around art. She said, I would like to do a program which looks at art galleries and looked at theatre shows. The person I am most jealous of at the moment is Mariella Frostrup, doing the Great Painting Challenge. I love my art, my galleries. I would love to do something to do with that. Jenny is currently traveling the country on her Grumpy Old Women tour with Dilly Keen and Lizzie Roper. Describing the show as Charlie's Angel style, she said, It's got a lot of charm. There are bits of it that are quite sensitive with how people's lives are. It's pretty fast moving and it touches on lots of subjects, and I think the nicest thing anyone could say about it is it has huge charm. Grumpy Old Women is on tour until the end of June. Schedule and tickets can be found here.